Obama stole the presidency. New report shows millions of illegals flipped the 2008 election. Democrats should be careful, because the shaky foundation beneath their feet is falling apart. The left has spent years painting conservatives as paranoid conspiracy theorists who complain about voter fraud instead of focusing on the real issues. That is why, according to the left, conservatives lose elections. But what happens when the truth comes out, and conservatives were right the whole time? Does the left then start to get paranoid? We should know the answers to these questions at some point in the near future, because the truth is indeed starting to come out. As reported by the Washington Times, a research group in New Jersey has taken a fresh look at past election polling data and concluded that the number of non-citizens voting illegally in U.S. elections is likely far greater than previous estimates. As many as 5.7 million non-citizens may have voted in the 2008 election, which put Barack Obama in the White House. The research organization Just Facts, a widely cited, independent think tank led by self-described conservatives and libertarians, revealed its number crunching in a report on national immigration. Just Facts President James D. Agresti and his team looked at data from an extensive Harvard, YouGov study that every two years questions a sample size of tens of thousands of voters. Some acknowledge they are not citizens and are thus ineligible to vote. There you have it, conservatives were right about voter fraud. When President Trump stated that he would have won the popular vote in addition to the Electoral College had no illegals voted in the 2016 election, liberals openly mocked him. As stated before, anyone who agreed with Trump was a loony conspiracy theorist. It did not take much to realize, however, then liberals had no actual response to these claims. They refuted the president's argument only by calling him a sore loser. They did not, on the other hand, actually prove him wrong. As it turns out, liberals did not prove Trump wrong because he simply was not wrong in the first place. A fresh batch of studies confirmed that millions of illegals may have voted for Hillary Clinton as well. What do you think, America? Should liberals be held accountable now that Americans have the proof? Is this a matter for the Justice Department, or should Democrats just pay for it at the polls? Let us know your thoughts below.